Good afternoon, friends. First, when I entered the hall, I thought it's going to be a big challenge. So the number of speakers listed is more than what I saw in the audience. And I don't think the position has changed much since. So we have a small group of people here. And I suppose they are very keen because uh, after a heavy lunch also, they would prefer not to take a serious time from here and listen to us. So I really congratulate you for that. Uh, friends, I think we should not be unfair to the next session. We have already been late by about half an hour in our starting the session. So I would like to complete by 3.15 sharp so that next session at least is in time. Unfortunately, one or two people have not turned up so far, so it's an easier thing for me to manage the session now. So as the session coordinator, I would request one, one by one each one of them to make a presentation to you. Uh, well, it's a bit unfair for the organizers to ask the uh, speakers to introduce themselves. I wish uh, they had the sense to introduce each one of the speakers properly. And that's part of the management. Why are we doing this conference? It is to improve the managerial skills of our country. And so the organizers should have been always very thought thoughtful enough to do this. Anyway, I don't know the comment on that. Friends, uh, we have the speakers with us. Uh, I'll first request Professor Xavier, who is the director of IIM Raji. As you know, IIM Nation of Management Raji is one of the new IIMs which has come up. I'm sure Professor Xavier has faced a very big challenge of starting a new IIT, a new IIM in uh, a place in a state called uh, Jharkhand, and uh, he must have successfully met with this challenge. Uh, Professor Xavier is uh, going to speak about uh, e-learning and uh, how e-learning can be connected with the management education and what they are planning to do in uh, his institute, the Rai and Raji. So I'll request Professor Xavier to please go ahead. Thank you, Professor Raji. Good afternoon, everyone. Uh, 